The Poland national football team Polish, Polski w. represents Poland in association football and is controlled by the Polish Football Association, the governing body for football in Poland. At the FIFA World Cup, the current best result for Poland are two bronze medals won in 1974 and 1982, with this era being regarded as the golden era of Polish international association football. At the Euros, Poland's best current result is reaching the quarter-finals in 2016, in Poland's third consecutive appearance at the competition. Poland's debut at the Euros was in 2008. They were co-hosts of the 2012 edition, along with Ukraine. Overall, Poland's best ever result in international football tournaments as a whole was the gold medal won at the 1972 Munich Olympics, along with winning the silver medal on two occasions, at the 1976 Montreal Olympics and at the 1992 Barcelona Olympics. History Topic 1919 to 1939 Early Years The first football federation was established on the 25th of June 1911 in Lwów as the Polish Football Union Związek Polski Piłki Noznej. After First World War members of PFU established on the 20th of December 1919 in Warsaw the Polish Football Federation Polski Związek Piłki Noznej. Poland would play its first official international match on 18 December 1921 in Budapest, where the side lost to Hungary 1–0. Their first international win would come on 28 May 1922 where they took on Sweden in Stockholm and beat them 2–1. Poland qualified for their first ever World Cup in 1937 when they beat Yugoslavia 4–0 and lost 1–0 in the two qualifying matches and ensured their place in the 1938 World Cup in France. During their debut in the World Cup, Poland would play Brazil in a match which would become one of the most memorable matches in World Cup history. Despite Brazil not being regarded as the world's top team in the 1930s, it was still believed to be a hard-to-beat side, having participated in two first World Cups. Under these circumstances, the Polish team, which had never before participated on such a level, was expected to lose the game against the South Americans. Thus, the defeat was not a sensation. However, all fans were surprised at the style with which the Poles played their lone game of the tournament. The White and Reds got to the extra time, only then losing 5-6. Ernest Wilimowski, who played for Ruch Chorzow at the time, scored four of Poland's five goals, which to date is one of the most impressive individual performances in the history of the World Cup. Poland played what would be their last international match before the outbreak of World War II against Hungary, the runners-up in the 1938 World Cup. The match stands out as an achievement as Poland defeated the strongly favoured Hungarian side 4-2. <laughs> Topic: 1946-1974, beginnings On the 11th of June 1946, following the aftermath of World War II, Poland played their first international friendly match, against Norway in Oslo, a 3-1 defeat. The biggest success in the early years after the war was the victory against one of Europe's best at the time, Czechoslovakia. Poland defeated their southern neighbours 3-1. Poland suffered the worst defeat in the team's history on 26 April 1948 with a 0-8 loss to the Danish side. Poland would later erase that memory as they posted their second highest ever victory in Szczecin when they took down Norway 9-0 on 4 September 1963. The game marked the debut for Wolodymyrz Lubanski. He scored one of the goals in the game. Lubanski became the all-time top scorer for Poland while playing from 1963 to 1980 scoring 48 goals in 75 appearances. This victory was surpassed on 1 April 2009 in Kielce when Poland defeated San Marino 10-0. On 1 December 1970, Polish football history would change forever all due to one man. Kazimierz Gorski was named head coach of the national team. His success with the team was evident from the start with a gold medal at the 1972 Summer Olympics. Gorski would later lead the team to another medal at the 1976 Olympics where they captured silver. 
However, nothing matched the two bronze medals at the 1974 and 1982 World Cups. Topic: 1974 to 1986 Golden Era. Poland being mostly unknown on the international football scene before 1974 shook up the football world during the World Cup in Germany. However, this was no huge surprise as the core of the team successfully achieved a gold medal place in the Munich Olympics in 1972. The Olympics were not considered a major tournament by most Western nations, but Eastern European countries bypassed the amateur rules by fielding their full national teams, as most players also had employment with national industries or within the army. With their lightning speed and incredible team chemistry they were almost unstoppable. In qualifying they surprised everyone by eliminating England, quarter-finalists in 1970 and champions in 1966. In their opening match of Germany, 74 Poland met Argentina, a team that was appearing in their sixth World Cup. Within eight minutes Poland were up 2-0, Zegos Lato opened the scoring in the seventh minute and just a minute later Andrzej Sarmik doubled the lead. In the 60th minute, Argentina cut the lead in half when Ramon Heredia scored. Two minutes later, however, Lotto scored his second, which turned out to be the winning goal as Carlos Babington gave Argentina their second in the 66th. The match finished 3-2 for Poland. Poland thrashed Haiti 7-0 in their second game. The goals included a hat-trick from Sarmic and two from Lotto. In their final match of the first stage, Poland met Italy, who finished second at the previous World Cup in 1970. Poland were already through to the second round but needed at least a draw to win the group. At half-time, Poland was leading 2-0 on goals from Andrzej Sarmik and Kazimierz Dana. It was not until the 86th minute that Italy managed a consolation goal through Fabio Capello. This gave Poland their third consecutive win, which led them to win the group. In the second round, Poland first won 1-0 against a Swedish side, which had not conceded any goals in their first three matches. Lotto scored the only goal of the game. Next was Yugoslavia, who had drawn with Brazil and Scotland and won 9-0 against Zaire in the first round. Poland was awarded a penalty in the 24th minute and took the lead when Dana converted. Stanislav Kurasi tied it up for Yugoslavia in the 43rd. Lotto won it for Poland again when he scored in the 62nd, making the final score 2-1 in Poland's favour. On 3 July 1974 came the game that could have sent Poland into the 1974 World Cup final. They played against the eventual champions West Germany. It had rained all day long, the field was entirely flooded. Poland wanted the game postponed but the Austrian referee would not agree. The game went ahead. Poland needed a win to be in the final, a draw was enough for the Germans. But in the miserably wet conditions, Poland's speed was of no use since the ball would not roll like it does on a dry field. Gerd Müller scored the winning goal in the 76th minute for Germany. The whole country was crushed. Poland would end the amazing run with a 1-0 victory over Brazil in the third-place game. Lotto scored the winning goal his seventh of the tournament crowning him the top scorer of the World Cup. In qualifying, Poland denied Portugal their second World Cup appearance when in 1966 they had captured third place. Poland opened the World Cup against their rivals from four years prior and the current champions, West Germany. This time the match ended in a 0-0 draw. Zegos Lato continued his scoring ways with the only goal in the 1-0 win over African side Tunisia in the second game. In the final first round match Poland met Mexico. Zbigniew Boniek playing in his first World Cup opened the scoring in the 43rd minute. The Mexicans drew level through Viktor Rangel in the 52nd minute, but four minutes later Kazimierz Dana put Poland ahead once again. Then Boniek scored his second in the 84th to secure the 3-1 win. In the second round, Poland met three South American teams. In 1974, Poland had played and won against both Argentina and Brazil, both teams would get their revenge this time around. First, Argentina beat the Poles 2-0 with two goals from tournament top scorer Mario Kempes. Poland then defeated Peru 1-0 with a goal from Andrzej Sarmik. In what was Poland's last match of this World Cup, Brazil opened the scoring in the 12th minute on a goal from Nelinho. 
Even though Lotto equalized one minute before half time, it was not to be for Poland. Two goals from Roberto in the 57th and 62nd minutes wrapped up the 3 1 win for Brazil. On 29 November 1980, a dispute between players and technical staff began at a hotel in Warsaw, ending in the Okachi Airport. Following the incident, several players of the Poland national team were banned from international duty, also leading to the resignation of Ryszard Kulesza as head coach of the team. At the 1982 FIFA World Cup, Poland were drawn in a group with Italy, Cameroon and Peru. The first two games were consecutive 0-0 draws with Italy and Cameroon, but the final group game of the first round ended in a 5-1 win for Poland, meaning they would advance to the second round as group winners. In the first game of the second round, Poland beat Belgium 3-0, with a hat-trick from Boniek securing him a classic performance in the match, but the player would also receive a yellow card in the following match. Nevertheless, Poland advanced as group winners to the knockout stage. However, Poland would eventually be stopped in the semi-finals, losing 0-2 to Italy and ending the dream of playing at the World Cup final once again, but also securing a place in the third-place playoff. In the third-place playoff, Poland beat France 3-2, with the game also being regarded as the end of the golden era of Polish football. In 1986 FIFA World Cup qualifying, Poland finished top of the qualifying group, with three wins, two draws and one defeat. Poland's biggest win of the qualifying phase was a 4-1 win over Greece, meanwhile Poland's biggest defeat was a 0-2 defeat to Belgium. At the 1986 FIFA World Cup, Poland were drawn into a group with England, Morocco and Portugal. The first match was a 0-0 draw, and in the second match, beat Portugal 1-0. In the final group game, they 0-3 to England, but Poland still advanced into the knockout stage, as a result of Morocco winning 3-1 over Portugal. In the round of 16, Poland were eliminated after suffering a 4-0 defeat to Brazil. Topic: 1986-2001 decline. After the golden era, from the 1970s and 1980s, Poland suffered a severe drought in international football, they didn't qualify for three consecutive editions of the FIFA World Cup, failing to qualify in 1990, 1994 and 1998. In 1990 World Cup qualifying, Poland finished third in the qualifying group, behind Sweden and England, on five points with two wins, one draw and three defeats. They began qualifying for the 1990 edition with a 1-0 win over Albania, before defeats to Sweden 2-1 and England 3-0. Poland then drew 0-0 with England, lost to Sweden 0-2 and beat Albania 2-1 in their final game, but were four points behind England, thus failing to qualify. In 1994 World Cup qualifying, Poland finished fourth in the qualifying group, behind Norway, the Netherlands and England. Poland began qualifying with 1-0 win over Turkey, followed by a 2-2 draw with the Netherlands, a 1-0 win over San Marino and a 3-0 win in the reverse fixture. Afterwards, Poland drew 1-1 with England, before a 0-3 defeat in the reverse fixture. Afterwards, Poland would then go on to suffer consecutive defeats, losing 1-0 and 3-0 to Norway, followed by a 2-1 defeat to Turkey and a 1-3 defeat to the Netherlands in the final fixture. In Euro 1996 qualifying, Poland drew a qualifying group with Romania, France, Slovakia, Israel and Azerbaijan. Poland lost 2-1 to Israel in the first game, and would later record a 1-0 win over Azerbaijan and a 0-0 draw with France. Later, Poland lost 2-1 to Romania, beat Israel 4-3 and Slovakia 5-0, before consecutive draws with France 1-1 and Romania 0-0. Poland lost 4-1 to Slovakia in the penultimate qualifying game, and drew 0-0 with Azerbaijan in the final group game. In 1998 World Cup qualifying, Poland finished third behind England and Italy. They began qualifying with a 2-1 loss to England before a win over Moldova 2-1 and a 0-0 draw with Italy. Afterwards, they suffered successive defeats to Italy 3-0 and England 0-2. They won the next two games, 4-1 over Georgia and 3-0 over Moldova, with Andrei Juskowiak scoring a hat-trick against the latter. The final game was against Georgia, with Poland losing 0-3. 
2001–2006, rebuild Poland qualifying for the 2002 World Cup was significant, as it was Poland's first appearance at the World Cup Finals since 1986. Poland's biggest win overall at in the qualifying phase was a 4-0 win over Armenia, while Poland's biggest defeat was a 1-4 defeat to Belarus. The Polish drew a group featuring South Korea, the United States and Portugal. The first match was played with South Korea on 4 June, with Poland losing 2-0. The second game was with Portugal on 10 June, which Poland lost 4-0. Poland then played the United States in the final group game on 14 June, winning 3-1 with goals from Olesadby, Krzysztof and Zewalakow. Despite the win, Poland finished last in the group, with a goal difference of minus 4 and 3 points. Poland's qualifying for the 2006 FIFA World Cup was overall successful, as they won 8 and lost 2, without a single draw. They finished behind England in the qualifying group, but as a result of being the second-best second-placed team in the playoffs, they qualified automatically for the finals in Germany. The biggest win of the qualifying phase for Poland was an 8-0 victory over Azerbaijan, in which Tomasz Frankowski scored a hat-trick. The biggest defeat of the qualifying phase for Poland were two defeats against England, losing both home and away games by a scoreline of 1-2. At the 2006 World Cup, Poland drew Germany, Ecuador and Costa Rica in Group A despite high hopes from the Polish press, media and fans. Poland's campaign at the World Cup was seen as an underachievement, as Poland lost two and won one game, finishing third in the group. Poland's first match was a 2-0 defeat to Ecuador, followed by a 1-0 defeat to Germany, with Oliver Neuville scoring a stoppage time winning goal, with the defeat to Germany, and following Ecuador's 3-0 win over Costa Rica, officially ending Poland's chances of advancing further than the group. The third and final group game saw Poland defeat Costa Rica 2-1, with Bartosz Bosaki getting on the scoresheet twice. Topic 2008 debut at the Euros. In Euro 2008 qualifying, Poland were drawn into a group with Portugal, Serbia, Finland, Belgium, Kazakhstan, Armenia, and Azerbaijan. Poland's campaign began in uncomfortable fashion, suffering a 1-3 defeat to Finland on the 2nd of September 2006, and then drawing 1-1 with Serbia on the 6th of September. In the third match, on 7 October, Poland won 1-0 over Kazakhstan, with Eusebius Smolarek scoring the goal. On the 11th of October, Poland beat Portugal 2-1 with Smolarek scoring the two goals. On 15 November, they beat Belgium 1-0. On 24 March 2007, Poland beat Azerbaijan 5-0, and on 28 March beat Armenia 1-0. On 2 June, they beat Azerbaijan 3-1 with Smolarek and Krynowek scoring. On 6 June, Poland lost 1-0 to Armenia, on 8 September drew 2-2 with Portugal, and on 12 September drew 0-0 with Finland. On 13 October, Poland beat Kazakhstan 3-1 with a hat-trick from Smolarek. On 17 November, they beat Belgium 2-0 with two goals from Smolarek, and on 21 November drew 2-2 with Serbia in the final qualifying game, thus qualifying for the tournament as the first-place team in the qualifying group following Portugal's 0-0 draw with Finland, Poland's first-ever Euro appearance. At UEFA Euro 2008, they were drawn in Group B, with Germany, Austria and Croatia. The opening match was against Germany on 8 June at the Hypo Arena in Klagenfurt, a match that Poland lost 2-0 with two goals from Lukas Podolski. In the second game, Poland drew 1-1 with Austria, taking the lead through Brazil-born Roger Guerrero, before conceding in the third minute of stoppage time following a controversial penalty. The final group game was against Croatia, which Poland lost 1-0, finishing bottom of the group. 2010, disaster in World Cup qualifying In 2010 FIFA World Cup qualifying, Poland were drawn in a group with Slovakia, Slovenia, the Czech Republic, Northern Ireland and San Marino, and this has been Poland's worst qualifying campaign to date. Poland finished fifth in the group, just above San Marino, with 11 points. 
Poland began the campaign with a 1–1 draw against Slovenia on 6 September 2008. On 10 October, Poland beat San Marino 2–0. On of October, they won 2–1 against the Czech Republic. After these two wins, Poland lost consecutive matches against Slovakia, the 15th of October, losing 1 to 2, and Northern Ireland, the 28th of March 2009, losing 2 to 3. After these defeats, Poland recorded their biggest ever win, winning 10 to 0 against San Marino in which six different players scored, with Eusebius Smolarek scoring four goals on the 1st of April 2009. On 5 September, Poland drew 1–1 with Northern Ireland and on 9 September, lost 3–0 to Slovenia. On 10 October, Poland lost 2–0 to the Czech Republic and on 14 October, lost 1–0 to Slovakia. <laughs> 2012, host of the Euros On 18 April 2007, in Cardiff, Poland and Ukraine were selected to host UEFA Euro 2012 by the UEFA Executive Committee. The bid defeated other bids made, including one from Italy and a joint bid by Croatia and Hungary, thus becoming the third successful joint bid made to host the UEFA European Championship, after the Netherlands and Belgium in 2000, and Austria and Switzerland in 2008. Poland were drawn into Group A, with Greece, Russia and the Czech Republic. On 8 June, the opening match played between Poland and Greece at the Stadion Narodowy in Warsaw, ended 1–1, with Poland taking the lead in the 17th minute through Robert Lewandowski before Greece equalised in the second half through Dimitri Salpangidis in the 51st minute, and in the game, both teams went down to 10 men. Poland's next game was on 12 June, again played at the Stadion Narodowy in Warsaw, with the game against Russia finishing 1–1, with Russia taking the lead through Alan Zagoyev in the 37th minute before Poland equalised through Blaszczykowski in the 57th minute. Poland's final game was against the Czech Republic, played on 16 June, at the Stadion Mieski, in Wrocław, where Poland lost 1–0 following a goal from Petr Jiracek. Poland finished bottom of the group, with just two points. Topic 2014 World Cup qualifying. Poland was drawn in Group H of 2014 FIFA World Cup qualifying with England, Ukraine, Montenegro, Moldova, and San Marino. On the 7th of September, Poland's first qualifying match ended in a 2-2 draw with Montenegro, with goals from Blaszczykowski and Mirzejewski. On the 11th of September, they beat Moldova 2-0 with goals from Blaszczykowski and Warzyniak. On 17 October, Poland drew 1–1 with England, with Glick scoring the equalising goal. On the 22nd of March 2013, Poland lost 3–1 to Ukraine, conceding two goals in the first seven minutes alone, with Piszczek scoring Poland's only goal. On 26 March, Poland beat San Marino 5–0, with a brace from Lewandowski, and goals from Piszczek, Teodorczyk and Kaseki. On 6 September, Poland drew 1–1 with Montenegro, with Lewandowski scoring the equalising goal only five minutes after Poland initially conceded. On 10 September, they beat San Marino 5–1, with a brace from Zielinski, and goals from Blaszczykowski, Sobota and Mirzejewski. However, Poland lost the last two games against Ukraine and England, losing 1–0 and 2–0, respectively. 2016 to 2018 new era 2016 euro quarter final and 2018 world cup qualifying In UEFA Euro 2016 qualifying, Poland were drawn in Group D, with Germany, Scotland, the Republic of Ireland, Georgia and Gibraltar. On 7 September 2014, Poland beat Gibraltar 7–0, with Robert Lewandowski scoring four goals, Kamil Grosicki scoring two goals and Lukasz Szczykala scoring one goal. On the 11th of October, Poland beat Germany 2-0, with Germany having won the 2014 FIFA World Cup only three months prior, with goals from Arkadius Milik and Sebastian Mila. On the 14th of October, Poland drew 2-2 with Scotland, with goals from Krzysztof Mazinski and Milik not being enough to secure the three points. On the 14th of November, they beat Georgia 4-0, with goals from Kamil Glick, Jegosz Krychowiak, Mila and Milik. 
On 29 March 2015, they drew 1–1 with the Republic of Ireland, with Slavomir Peshko, but conceded a goal from Shane Long in stoppage time. On 13 June, they beat Georgia 4–0, with a goal from Milik and a hat-trick from Lewandowski. On 7 September, they beat Gibraltar 8–1, with Grosicki, Lewandowski and Milik all scoring twice, and Jakub Blaszczykowski and Bartosz Kapustka. On 8 October, they drew 2–2 with Scotland, with Lewandowski scoring a brace. On the 11th of October, they beat the Republic of Ireland 2–1 with goals from Krihaujak and Lewandowski, securing automatic qualification for the Euros. At the UEFA Euro 2016 finals, Poland were drawn in Group C, with Germany, Northern Ireland and Ukraine. Poland's first match was with Northern Ireland, on 12 June at the Stade de Nice in Nice, a game they won 1-0 with a goal from Arcadius Milik in the 51st minute. The next match was with Germany at the Stade de France in Saint-Denis on 16 June, with the finishing 0-0. Poland's final group game was with Ukraine on 21 June, at the Stade Velodrome in Marseille, a game they won 1–0 with a goal from Jakub Blaszczykowski. In the round of 16, Poland were drawn to play Switzerland on 25 June at the Stade Geoffroy Guichard in saint Etienne. Poland took the lead through a goal from Blaszczykowski, but conceded a bicycle kick from Jerdan Shakiri in the 82nd minute, finishing the game 1–1 in regular time. After even extra time could not break the tie, Poland beat Switzerland in a penalty shootout, winning 5-4 on penalties. On 30 June, at the Stade Velodrome in Marseille played with Portugal in the quarter-finals of the tournament, a game in which Poland took the lead in the second minute through a goal from Robert Lewandowski before conceding a goal from Renato Sanchez in the 33 nd minute. The match was 1-1 even after regular time and extra time ended, thus taking the game to penalties. Poland lost the penalty shootout, losing 5-3 with Blaszczykowski having the crucial penalty saved. In 2018 FIFA World Cup qualifying, Poland were drawn in Group E, with Denmark, Montenegro, Romania, Armenia and Kazakhstan. The opening match for Poland was against Kazakhstan on 4 September 2016, which Poland drew 2-2, taking a 2-0 lead through goals from Bartosz Kapustka and Robert Lewandowski, but they conceded two goals from Sergei Kiznachenko in the second half. On 8 October, Poland beat Denmark 3-2 with Lewandowski scoring a hat-trick. Three days later, on the 11th of October, they beat Armenia 2-1, with goals from Lewandowski and an own goal from Harar Mikoyan. On the 11th of November, Poland beat Romania 3-0 with Kamil Grosicki and Lewandowski scoring the goals. On 26 March 2017, Poland beat Montenegro 2-1 with Lewandowski and Lukasz Piszczek scoring the goals. On 10 June, Poland beat Romania 3-1 with a hat-trick from Lewandowski. However, on 1 September, they suffered a 4–0 defeat to Denmark, their first loss of their qualifying campaign. Three days later, they beat Kazakhstan 3–0 with goals from Arkadius Milik, Kamil Glick and Lewandowski. On 5 October, they trashed Armenia 6–1, with goals from Grosicki, Jakub Blaszczykowski, Rafal Volski and a hat-trick from Lewandowski, who became Poland's record goalscorer in the match. Three days later, on 8 October, Poland officially qualified for the tournament with a 4–2 win over Montenegro, with goals from Krzysztof Mazinski, Grosicki, Lewandowski and an own goal from Filip Stojkovic. Lewandowski scored 16 goals during qualifying, breaking the European qualifying scoring record, as well as becoming the all-time top goalscorer of Poland. Topic. 2018, disappointment at the World Cup Poland played at the 2018 FIFA World Cup, their first World Cup since 2006, in Group H, against Senegal, Colombia and Japan. Despite the group being considered a close group, Poland were tipped as favourites to advance from the group. In May 2018, Poland named the preliminary 34-man squad, and on 4 June, they named the final 23-man squad. 
The squad featured several notable players, such as elite striker Robert Lewandowski playing at his first World Cup, VFL Wolfsburg's veteran midfielder Jakub Blaszczykowski, Monaco defender Camille Glick who suffered an injury two weeks prior to the start of the tournament, Napoli forward Arcadius Milik and Juventus goalkeeper Wojciech Szczesny. However, despite all of this and despite being ranked 8th in the FIFA ranking prior to the tournament, Poland's tournament was disappointing overall, they lost to Senegal in the opening match, losing 1-2 on 19 June in Moscow. Five days later, on 24 June, they lost to Colombia in Kazan, losing 0-3, which mathematically ended their hopes of qualifying from the group and on 28 June, beat Japan 1-0 in their final group game in Volgograd. Poland finished bottom of their group. Topic. 2018–2019 UEFA Nations League and UEFA Euro 2020 qualifying The qualifying group stage draw was held on 2 December 2018 in Dublin, Republic of Ireland. The 55 teams were drawn into 10 groups, 5 groups of 5 teams groups AE and 5 groups of 6 teams groups FJ. Ranked at number 10 in Pot 1, Poland was drawn into UEFA Euro 2020 qualifying Group G. Group G consists of six teams, Austria, Israel, Latvia, Macedonia, Poland and Slovenia, where they will play against each other home and away in a round-robin format. The top two teams will qualify directly for the finals. Unlike previous editions, the participants of the playoffs will not be decided based on results from the qualifying group stage, but instead based on their performance in the 2018-19 UEFA Nations League. In 2018 Poland was drawn into Group 3 in the 2018-19 UEFA Nations League A, along with Portugal and Italy. Topic. Competitive record Topic. FIFA World Cup Topic. Olympic Games Topic. UEFA European Championship Topic. UEFA Nations League Asterisk denotes draws including knockout matches decided on penalty kicks. Asterisk asterisk gold background color indicates that the tournament was won. Asterisk 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 red border color indicates tournament was held on home soil. Topic. FIFA ranking history Source Topic. Honours FIFA World Cup Third Place, 1974, 1982 UEFA European Championship Quarter Finals, 5th Place, 2016 Football at the Summer Olympics Gold Medalists, 1972 Silver Medalists, 1976, 1992 Topic. Team image Topic. Names The official FIFA country code for Poland is Pol. This abbreviation is used to identify the team in FIFA, UEFA, and other matches. The same abbreviation is also used under the International Organization for Standardization. Polish national football team can be translated into Polish as Reprezentacja Polski W. Pilcze Noznej. The team's nicknames include Bialo Czerwony, which means the White Reds, and Orly, which translates into the Eagles. These are the most common names given to the Polish national football team. In English, the team is also widely known as the White Eagles, based on Poland's national coats of arms. Topic: <laughs> National kits. The national kits of Poland reflect the colors of the national flag which are white and red. 
Apart from minor details in the 1920s the socks and the home kit were striped, the design remains unchanged since 1921. The home kit consists of a white shirt, red shorts and white socks, the away kit is all red though sometimes worn with white shorts. On the rare occasions when both home and away kits clash with the opponents, a color's third kit is available, usually in either black or blue currently navy blue with white red sleeves. The kit has traditionally been adorned with the white eagle until 2006, the coat of arms featured the inscription Polska in capital letters above the eagle, the Polish coat of arms, and not, as with many other national teams, the National Football Federation logo. The Euro 2012 kits were the first to feature the logo of the PZPN, however, when the kit was first launched it did not include the iconic coat of arms with the white eagle. After only a few matches, the coat of arms made its return on the national kits. Since 2009, the current kits are provided by Nike. Topic: Kit providers. Topic: Stadiums. Topic: Main stadiums. Silesian Stadium in Chorzów was built in 1956 and seats 47,246 people. The record attendance came on 20 October 1956, when 100,000 fans witnessed a game between Poland and the Soviet Union, with Poland winning 2-1. This holds the record for the most spectators to watch Poland. The stadium is being renovated to seat 55,210 and is set to open in September 2017. In 1993, the stadium was designated as the official home stadium of the Poland national team. A new national stadium was constructed in Warsaw with an expected capacity of 58,145 seats. Following Euro 2012, it has been used as the venue for all qualifying matches and some friendly matches of the Poland national team. Other stadiums Poland national football team plays selected matches at other major Polish stadiums, including Stadion Energia Gdańsk, Wrocław City Stadium, Anea Stadion. Topic: Results and fixtures. Topic: 2018. Topic twenty nineteen. Topic Coaching Staff. Topic Players. Topic Current Squad. The following players have been called up for the friendly match against Czech Republic and the 2018-19 UEFA Nations League match against Portugal in November 2018. Caps and goals updated as of the 20th of November 2018 after the match against Portugal. Caps and goals including all matches officially recognized by PZPN, also those not recognized by FIFA. Topic: Recent call-ups. The following players have been called up for the national team in the last 12 months. Topic: Previous squads. Topic: Notable players. Players who appeared at least 50 times for the national team or scored at least 10 goals. Bold – indicates player with at least 50 caps and 10 goals. Head-to-head <inaudible> <inaudible> -head records of Poland Managers <inaudible> 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 
Modis, Imre Posanyi and Leo Beenhecker were the only foreign managers to coach the Poland national football team. See also Poland national youth football teams Poland women's national football team Football in Poland History of football in Poland Polish Championship in Football Polish Cup Polish Supercup Sports in Poland <laughs>